at Madison Square Garden where James Tony has just dethroned WBA champion John Ruiz. And with me, I have none other than Roy Jones Jr. Roy, how are you feeling tonight, sir? I'm feeling wonderful. All right. So what do you think about the fight? And break it down for us on how it went. Well, the fight went just like I told him it would. James is much too quick for Ruiz. Then, to make it worse, Ruiz changed his fighting style. His ugly fighting style is the best fighting style he had. He's trying to please the public. You can't please the public and win. You got to dance with the dan with the person that you bought to the dance. You don't go out and change because the people want you to change. And that's what he did. And when he did that, I knew James' chances to beat him were going to be better than mine because he tried to change his fight plan. He cannot beat a former middleweight champion trying to stay outside and outboxing. That's very dumb. Right. So what does this fight here do for the heavyweight division? Make the heavyweight division a little bit more interesting because now those guys who may have had a chance to sneak in and steal the title, they can't sneak in and steal it from James Tony because his hands too quick. He's going to make them have to work for it. You're a guy who knows James Tony. You're familiar with him. You fought with him in the past. I mean, did you see any difference in him, any change in his style? No, I saw no change in his style. He's still the same old James Tony. I mean, James is James, and that's what he is. Now, if you're not smart, you're not going to beat him. So what's the latest with you, Roy? What's, what, what, what can we expect from you and when? I'm chilling, doing it real big, you know what I'm saying? It's body head to the end, to the day I die. Y'all know how I go. Go get that body head back in volume one, keep repping that body head. And, you know, I'm just going to lay out and take it easy, you know what I'm coming from? About to decide I want to come back. I can. I see can't nobody beat me. I mean, you know, so I mean, I just got to do what I got to do if that's what I want to do. But right now I'm going to cheat. I'm going to see what my fans want. If my fans tell me to come back and kick ass, I come back and kick ass. If your fans tell you to go to heavyweight and fight James Tony in the rematch, would you do that? You know me now. Come on now. Come on. What's my name? Roy Jones. Who? Roy Jones. <laughs> you so, know if I, my fans tell me to come back and do what I got to do, I got to be there. So, Roy, what do you what do you think about the May 14 fight between Ricky Wright and uh, Tito Trinidad? I think it's a wonderful fight. I think it's a great fight. Styles make fights. You got a classical boxer and a classical puncher, and that's always the best fight you can make. And you can't call out coming with that off the top. I mean, myself, I kind of get an edge to Tito because of his punching power, but Winky is hungry. So anything you want to say to your fans and the people all around the world? Thank y'all for supporting Roy Jones Jr. Y'all know how raw I am. Y'all know how raw I was. Y'all know I was the man. I still am if I want to be. Thank y'all. Keep repping by the head till y'all get through. You Roy, appreciate you.